Yay. So I'm going to get us started, but we've got a great lineup today. It's myself and Miranda and Joni. I'm going to just play a few Christmas carols for you. If you guys didn't know this, you know, we have all sorts of rhythms on these instruments that can give us amazing holiday sounds, but in a pinch, you only need three. Sleigh bells for your songs that don't swing, jingle jangles for your songs that do swing, and lullaby, put on drum variation and altar style, and you get jingle bells added on. And with those three rhythms combined, that lullaby is for your three-quarter time rhythms, you can go through the whole Christmas book and play every song. It's going to sound great. I'm just going to be using the sleigh ride rhythm today, and I'm going to do a big, long medley of some classic Christmas carols and, uh, and one Leroy Anderson song. Here we go.
Oh, thank you guys. You're too kind. That was my Christmas Carol medley, and that was also my time. So give it up, because up next is Miss Miranda Backer. Hello, everyone. Uh, give me just a moment to situate the microphone, and we will get started. Um, so. I don't know if everyone is as nostalgic for a Charlie Brown Christmas this time of year as me, but I really wanted to do an assortment of songs, of uh, Vince Guaraldi's songs, partially from a Charlie Brown Christmas. Um, it means a lot to me, and I hope you really enjoy it. Uh, we're going to be starting off today with a little bit of Christmas Time is Here, using the Jazz Waltz. Jazz Waltz is my favorite one that I have found for this song. And I'm going to be using preset number eight on uh, your normal on the A series or vintage if you have an E series because I really, really like the jazz piano with this. Because remember, this is a Vince Guaraldi tune. you I hope you enjoyed that um, so for my next song does everyone know the Linus and Lucy theme from the Peanuts cartoons um, did you know if you have the rhythm Tito's big band and some other various buttons you can duplicate that almost perfectly so I'm going to my Latin category I'm gonna go find Tito's big band and then I'm just going to make a couple tweaks. We're going to press alter style. We're going to press drum variation. Though you don't have to do the drum variation. I prefer it that way. I'm going to switch to auto bass 2. I'm going to turn off my Orc Plus. And then I'm going to go into my keypad. I'm going to touch number 1 because that's a grand piano. And I'm going to put the grand piano in my bass by touching auto bass 2 again. This will make my bass player be playing a grand piano instead. One more little tweak I'm going to make is press my duet harmony for my upper keyboard. That's going to make it so when I have my piano on the top keyboard, it'll be playing two notes. And listen to how good this sounds.
Ooh, I put on the applause, but they are, they're still fading out. <laughs> Hi, right, thank you everyone. I really hope you enjoyed that. It is such a fun little song to play. And here, maybe you can even see it. Um, the sheet music for it in Easy Play. If you can see it on your screen Are from you my screen. Can you hear since she's at home? I can't hear you. Oh, you can't hear me. Is that any better? Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> okay, good. Uh, but the sheet music for this song is really, really simple. It's not that hard. Let the instrument do all the work for you and you just have all the fun. All right, so I'm gonna do one more tune from the Charlie Brown Christmas special. Um, does anyone remember the scene at the end of the movie where they go over to Snoopy's doghouse, which is all decked out in all these Christmas decorations, and Charlie Brown has the sad tree, and all the kids go over to Snoopy's doghouse and they just go, shoop, 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 and then they go over to the Christmas tree, and then they do it there, and it's beautiful, and then they all get around and they, they sing, Hark the Herald Angels Sing. Now, when I was a kid, I thought it was so silly. They, they use the syllable Lou, like with an L, and they go Lou, 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 Lou. <laughs> I couldn't find that exact vocalization in the instrument, but I did find ooze that I like quite a bit. So we're going to do a really soft version of this with just our easy button. And to set this up, I'm going to start by putting on my easy button. Then in my keypad, I'm going to go to number 477, which is the vocal ooze that I liked the best. So if you want to write that down, 477. And then I'm going to touch my lower genius, which is going to put them into my easy button. Now we're going to do this a couple more times in different places. 477, I want them in my right hand too. So I'm going to go touch orchestra genius, number one, and then I'm going to go 477, touch orchestra genius number two, 477. There's other stuff in here. I was finding that the keyboards kind of had a different tone to them, so I'm going to put it everywhere because I don't want to be able to touch something and not get my kids singing. So 477, we're going solo genius one, 477, solo genius two, and 477 in our tab rail for genius. Well, I don't know if someone can't hear me or if that's just in the background. I'm going to go ahead and mute everybody again. Yeah, someone just hit it up in the comments too. Thank you, John. All right, so we've got number 477 in our lower genius or lower sounds upper genius or upper sounds, orchestral genius one and two, and solo genius one and two. So no matter where we press, we are definitely going to get our choir. I'm also going to go ahead and I'm going to put three-part harmony on my upper keyboard to further change up the feel of the two keyboards. And now I should be ready to play, but I'm going to do one more thing. I'm going to go into my golden harp. I'm going to put it on guitar pattern. And Golden Harp sounds absolutely beautiful when you put it in a song where there's just the easy button. So we're going to do that today. Now, when you use the easy button, you don't actually have tempo you have to worry about. But the tempo control will control how fast or slow the Golden Harp is moving. It doesn't mean you have to play along with it. You can slow down and speed up however you like while you play. But I found that a tempo of 100 for what I'm doing sounds really nice with the guitar pattern. And then I'm going to go back to my keypad one more time. And I'm going to grab that number one, which I remember is my grand piano from when we set up Linus and Lucy. And I'm going to touch Golden Harp Genius and put it in there. So I hope you like what I've come up with. <laughs>
simple little melody. Oh, right. Don't forget, stop will not stop your golden harp. <laughs> All right, everybody. I just wanted to do a little medley of a few Charlie Brown songs, some of which by Vince Guaraldi, and maybe that inspires you on Christmas morning to go put on a Vince Guaraldi album if you can find one on YouTube, because it really just feels like Christmas to me. So I hope everyone has a Merry Christmas. I will see you all after Christmas, hopefully not before the new year, but if I don't see you till the new year, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, and I'll see you soon. Up next, we have Miss Joni Venero. I turned it down for you. <laughs> well, good afternoon. Yeah, I have a few people coming in here still. That's good. I'm happy to see everybody. Thank you for being here to celebrate the sounds of the season with us and we're hoping you're having a wonderful time enjoying the music and i'm going to start off with need a little christmas i'm going to use a broadway rhythm for that and <clears throat> theater theater organ is you have your choice of theater organ or opener so i'm going to start with opener as soon as I get untwisted from this, here we go. All right, I hope you enjoy it. That's good. Well, now you should be in the Christmas spirit by now, hopefully. And I'm going to slow the pace down just a tad. Well, maybe not just a tad. Um, and I'm going to do for you Silver Bells, which is wonderful. Um, I prefer to use the... Um, Piano, smooth piano 3 4. So I'm getting tangled up here. Here we go. And so that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to find that by my keypad. Smooth piano 3 4. And that background is very good with silver bells. You can also use uh, Smooth Orchestra 3-4 or Lullaby. And then we have our Bells category, which is really fun to use. So it gives me all different types of bells, which I'm going to utilize in my Bells category. So I hope that you enjoy this.
Thank you. Um, so this is our favorite time of year in this business because there's no better time for music, of course. And in addition to that, there's no better time that we get to make dreams come true. That's a very important thing for all of us who work for Fletcher Music Centers, and we're very happy to represent them. And I'd like to tell you about making your dreams come true. We have every year at the end of the year, we have what's called a year-end inventory liquidation. Your last chance to save 75%, up to 75%, um, great, great opportunities on all our in-stock inventory. We also have new music books with 15% off. No reasonable offer will be refused. And we take anything on trade that doesn't eat. That's right, anything. We've taken boats, cars, sofas, TVs, whatever it may be, we can take it in trade and make you an exceptional opportunity for the time of making your dreams come true. We also have four easy ways to purchase. 9.99 financing is available, up to 60 months, six months, same as cash. That's my favorite, because I feel like somebody's loaning me money for six months, it's great. All major credit cards are accepted and additional discount if you pay by cash or check. So that's the opportunity. There it is. That's my brief commercial. And I hope to see many more of you in the next week or so. There's only about, what is there now, 10 days left in, in December. And then we'll be in the next year. It's a scary time when it goes by so fast. but. Um, we're very glad that you spend your time with us and very grateful for your business. And I'm going to finish up now with, um, it's kind of a favorite of mine, and not a lot of people play it, but it's called Marshmallow World. And so we're going to use on that, I'm going to Broadway again, but this time I'm going to go to Theater Oregon and do it with the theater organ. And I hope you enjoy this.
Thank you so much. I hope you've had a wonderful time. We at Sun City are very happy to see you, and we hope you have a very, very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year, and we look forward to uh, serving you in 24 coming up pretty soon. So thanks for being here, and don't forget we have three more concerts tomorrow and then also a concert on Saturday as well. So you'll want to tune into those and have yourself a very Merry Christmas. Thanks for being here. Bye-bye. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Thank you.